bedrock of our philosophy. We do not celebrate with chinnam and douchebags. 37,000 goddamn points. And we're back by 45. Only lost 35 points in that race. You know, all things considered, that's not even terrible. Time to just hang out of Texas. No, I am not signing autographs. Does it look like I am in the mood for a bullshit minigame? I bought Call of Duty Black Ops yesterday. The original. On PS3. I borrowed that game from some guy. Eight years ago, dude. I haven't played it in eight years nearly. I should play it for the channel. Anyway, so we're back to the lead of Texas. This track is the bane of my existence. Can't wait to see what, what's going to happen when we go here in the Cup Series. Okay, okay, alright, okay. So, we're going to have a bunch of rivals and worn tires for absolutely no reason. So that's how this race is going to go. Neat. There's a nice impossible lap for you. 29.4. Let's see if I can beat that on the track. That's actually not a bad lap time for today, I think. I don't know what they would go around this place. Yeah, fuck you. I did nothing, and you're my rival now. I did absolutely nothing, and now I have a logo rival, which is just my favorite thing in the world. I love me a logo rival. So, Oh yeah, and I gotta, I gotta remember that you can flat foot one and two. Gotta remember that. Gotta get up to get down. Cool. That's that's gonna help me get through turns one and two. Yeah, you wrecked yourself, you fucking moron. Good work. Good goddamn work. Fucking top bats on that one. There you go, you genius. Great work. Spectacular job there. Ugh. Can we please go one lap under green? Oh great, now this now the best lap's even more impossible. You know, this is just a series of unfortunate events at this point. Things are just things are gonna get worse before they get better. This has kind of been the story of the series. No god damn it. Well this guy isn't gonna draft with me, I know that much. There we go. Perfect. See I got him back I got one back on him. I got one back on him that time. That hardly ever happens. Is this race longer than the than the other Texas race? Because I swear most of the races in this game are 16 laps of these tracks, but this one is 18. This feels like the Coke 600 of the truck series. Yep, and my nose itches. This is a this is a great turn of events. All right. Oh. How am I supposed to flat foot turns one and two if I can't even get through three and four right? All right, there we go. Just leave the inside open. He didn't take it for some reason. Flat foot. Lead foot. There we go. This guy's still up my ass, but we accomplished something at least. All right, perfect. Finally. All right, there we go. Now we just need to survive down pit lane. And we might be able to win this shit, finally. I still think there's absolutely no way I'm winning this race. See, I just didn't flat foot one and two again, so there, here they come. Here comes the cavalry. They take no prisoners in this series, dude. Because even when you have a five-star destroying the field level truck, you're still subject to... Being put in the wall by a douchebag. Thank you. That ex that was extremely necessary, you fucking bitch piece of shit. Give me the push, Brandon. We need to catch this asshole and, and give him what for. Okay, we're stupid loose. Or we could be stupid loose. That's also a thing. That is a thing. Why am I so loose suddenly? Alright, you know what? We're pitting. This lap's terrible, we may as well pit. And I run a terrible lap time, just go down pit road, and and that'll make up for it? Probably not, but it'll be better than having to put up with doing another lap 
on shitty tires, but we're gonna have to do another lap on shitty tires on this universe, so let's run through the field here. Come on, guys. They feel so slow, but that was an okay transition. Okay, well, we're just gonna sit there and lose spots. Awesome. So, we just lost four spots on pit road because we just sat there for no reason for a while. That was really necessary. And now the leader is all the fucking way over there. That's great. It's really awesome. It's really awesome how there's a whole bunch of fucking moving chicanes that I have to drive around now before I get to the front. Cool. And there's a bunch of... Okay, that could have been a caution, which would have ended my race, but... It would have been funny, at least. Wow. Wow, look at this. We had to have lost around 11 spots on that stop, because this... This is fucking unacceptable. Wow. Fucking wow. We had to. We fucking lost like 10 spots. That stop wasn't even that bad. It wasn't a good stop because he just sat there for a while. What the hell, dude? And that motherfucker is still leading. I told you I wasn't winning this shit. Well, we're just going to go through four wide. Four wide out of turn two. That was a... That was a thing, to say the least. And of course there's someone on my inside, because when isn't there someone on my inside? So yeah, we had to have lost around 15, 16 spots on that stop. But this truck is just so fucking powerful, it doesn't care. It just doesn't care. And now that I'm actually flat-footing one and two, it's making a difference. So now we're finally going to catch the guy that beat us off the actual pit road. That only took three laps, even in this OP truck. Oh my god, dude. How the hell did we have that bad of a stop? Like, it... It wasn't even that bad. He just sat there for like half a second is all. It wasn't even that bad of a stop. That was a, that was a Bristol level loss of time. In a fucking mile and a half track where you'd only lose maybe like a hundred feet. Instead, we lost like 2,000 feet. That was fucking ridiculous. Just a terrible goddamn trip down pit lane. And we're wrecking. We got a new fucking rival, and basically nothing's changed. Now we're gonna get a new impossible best lap. There's just... I fucking hate this goddamn track, dude. No matter what I do, no matter what the fuck I do, this always happens at this fucking track. I'm never going to win here in this fucking place. Oh, cool. A logo rival. I totally deserve that, despite the fact that all I did was go try and pass this guy, and it just magnetized into the wall, and now we're losing more fucking spots, because there's people on my fucking inside. Endless shit. Just the endless, never fucking ending train of misery. And now I'm getting arrow pushed up to the outside. I'm sure someone's digging. I'm sure someone's trying to full send to my inside now, and they can do it since I body slam the wall there. Man, I hate this fucking track, and like my stomach hurts now. So I, I'm afraid that if I yell, I'm gonna throw up everywhere. So I can only talk like this. Could you fucking move, dude? Oh, and look at this, John Wood coming in to swoop away the with the win again. He's taking the lead, but now they're swapping it back and forth. Which is, to be fair, the best possible outcome is that these guys side race side by side for the next two laps. Yeah, I'm winning. I'm gonna lose another photo finish in this race, aren't I? Yeah, I'm not even gonna have enough speed to get up there with a fucking corner like that. Alright, well, here we go. Oh, he gave me room. He probably didn't mean to, but he did. Now the entire field's wrecking. Oh, shit. Look at this! This bitch trying to arrow push.
pushed me into the wall. He gets past my Brandon Witt. You cunt. You fucking deserve that. Didn't I lose to Brandon Witt at this track last time? God damn it, dude. No, it was Quaffle. Fuck. We're gonna finish second at Texas again. God fucking damn it. Every fucking time we go to this track, it's always something. Always fucking something. I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate this fucking game. Oh, I hate it. Why are you celebrating? That was stupid. Oh, and don't forget, we got like two logo rivals out of that race. Are we finally going to Old Spice? Thank you, Jesus. Alright, so. If you didn't figure it out last time when we were at Lowe's, the fucking 10 phase operation was to get the lead and screw over Hornaday. Well, basically, the only thing we can hope for in this race is that we qualify up front and can screw over Hornaday. Because since it's Old Spice, it's an easy track that I can make up time again when, when, when I do manage to screw him over. And it's a long track, so I hopefully won't get lapped while screwing him over. But it may get interesting trying to screw him over in any case because road courses are so weird. And how the AI is going to react. Sometimes they'll go full send. Other times they just, they'll just they be like a lane away from you and they'll still be slow. So, God only knows what's going to happen in this race. Fuck! 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 I just pushed Piglet into a power-up! No! Go away! Go away! Ah! 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 This is rape! God damn it, this. This is rape! Ah! Where's my rape whistle? <laughs>